What is going on, ladies and gentlemen? Poketrist here, bringing you guys episode number seven of our Learning Laddering series right here in the OU tier. If you guys are excited, make sure you leave a like, comment, subscribe down below if you haven't already. Now, if you guys are excited for OU, I am excited for OU as well. If you're not excited, then I'm still excited, all right? I don't even know what I was trying to get. I was, I, I was just trying to do the thing again, but I already did it once. But anyways, we're going to jump into some OU battles. This is a boring, standard OU team. You guys see boring, standard right there? Yeah, boring standard OU team, but I want to ladder up some. I uh, haven't really done any laddering in OU since the uh, since the reset, so uh, I need to ladder up. I think I'm at the bottom of the ladder right now. I think I'm in last place, so we're going to do some laddering here. Hopefully, we can uh, make it do what it do. You know, hopefully, we can uh, get some wins here. You know, that would be great to get some wins. Get some wins. All right, anyway, he is got – he has a pretty interesting team. No spinners, so – uh, looks like Heatran is my lead. Um, it, it's an interesting team. He's got like three Megas right now that I can see. I'm assuming it's a Mega Sharpedo because why would you bring a regular Sharpedo? Anyway, I'm just going to get up rocks. Wait, he doesn't have Mag... Okay, he doesn't have Magic Bounce. Good. So I'm going to get up rocks here. Uh, he has no way of getting... getting uh, uh, huh? He has Earthquake on that. That's crazy. He has no way... I have no way of... What am I talking about? He has no way of getting rocks up. Or getting rid of rocks. Gosh, I, I am just struggling today. I don't know what is happening. But, whatever. I'm going to just Thunderbolt for free. No Thunderbolt switch-ins either. He's going to go for an Ice Punch. Calm down, Dusk Noire. Why are you bodying my team like this? Please. I have nothing for him except for Bisharp. I guess I go into Bisharp on his Ice Punch. That, he got the freeze. He got the freeze. I repeat, ladies and gentlemen, he got the freeze. And I stayed frozen. Fire Punch. Why did I get frozen? He's not out speeding me. I'm just going to go for a Pursuit. I kind of want to go for Pursuit in case he switches out. But alas, he does not. We are going to get a knockoff on him. And uh, that, that's crazy. That does know where I just bodied my whole team. That's absolutely absurd. <laughs> wow. If we wouldn't have gotten frozen, obviously he would have died uh, much sooner. But alas, we did get frozen. Um, I'm assuming he's going to protect here. Um, my best switch is Keldeo. Or I can just let Bisharp die. I need Bisharp for Gallade, I think, so... I don't want to let Bisharp die just yet. Um, my best switch in is Keldeo. Hoping, hoping that he goes for Protect. He goes for Waterfall instead. Fair enough. I can just Secret Sword, though. He doesn't actually have a switch in for this, except maybe Azumarill. Uh, if he wants to switch in Zard, Zard's still going to take Rock's damage, and that's going to be a lot. So He's just going to Zen Headbutt me, but this is going to kill him. Um, so there goes Sharpedo. I guess that's not his Mega. Um... Zen Headbutt Sharpedo. That's that's something. I mean, I've actually heard of people running that for Keldeo if they're going to run it no you, but I mean, like, really? This guy's team is just it's wild. <laughs> Did he have any stab on Dustnoir at all? I'm trying to think if he had any stab, but I can't think of it if he had any or not. I'm going to start the timer on this guy, too. Um, if the timer button would work. Is it just not going to work? Timer button? Are we okay? Pokemon Showdown? Did you freeze? Pokemon Showdown. Yeah, I'm going to reload Pokemon Showdown. <laughs> oh, no. Don't reload. Just kidding. We're good. Okay. All right, cool. So, he brought this in. Um, I could use this for Porygon. I have Focus Blast on uh, Thunderous for Porygon, though. And I can kill Porygon with a lot of other stuff. I'm just going to get off some damage on this. That's not going to do anything, though. It actually did a lot. He's got Leaf Blade. What is this? <laughs> What am I playing? Um, I am just going to go into my Ampharos. He's, he might have Ice Punch for all I know. I'm going to go into Bisharp. And I'm going to go for a Sucker Punch. Okay? No, I'm going to Pursuit. This guy's wild. He's going to attack me. I'm going for Sucker. No way he switches out. I knew it. This guy's wild. There's no way he was switching out. I knew it. This is crazy. Bottom of the ladder, man. Bottom of the ladder. This guy's wild. I'm going to Iron Head. I don't know what he's going to do, but he's going to try attack and kill me, which is fine. I don't need Bisharp anymore. Um, that gives me a free switch into my... I wish I could go into Keldeo. I wish I would have saved it. But alas, I did not. I'm going to go into Thunderous and go for a Focus Blast. And hope that we hit... Oh, he outsped. He scarfed. Ooh, that makes things a little tougher. Um, interesting, though. Interesting, nonetheless. He scarfed Porygon. Try attack. Um, I'm going to go into Ampharos. I'm going to Mega Evolve, and I'm going to go for a... 
Volt switch. Assuming he stays in, he did. That did so much. So did that, though. Okay, I can sack Keytrand here. Yeah, I'm going to sack Keytrand and go right back into my Ampharos and Volt switch again. Um, yeah, that's the best play. I'm just going to Lava Plume, just in case he messes up. I don't think he's going to, though. All right, cool. I probably should have Toxic in case he messed up, but I didn't. Anyway, I can go into Ampharos and eat up another one of these uh, Tri-Attacks unless he crits me, which would be annoying. And then I can just Volt Switch out again. And uh, we do eat up that Tri-Attack. I'm just going to Volt Switch back. I should have rested. I should have rested. I should have rested. I think I'm going to lose now because I didn't go for rest. I wish I had Rock Slide on Excadrill now. I wish I had Rock Slide on Excadrill right now, but I don't. Okay. Huh? Iron Head's going to do a lot, guys. That's not killing Iron Head didn't kill either. What do I do? I lose. I lose. I just lost to this guy. No! That's crazy. This guy should never have beaten me. This Aqua Jet is going to kill me too at 14. I'm going to rest just in case. Please don't let it kill. Live! <gasps> we lived! Oh, we living. Ah, oh, nice. All right, now I get to sleep talk. He's just going to play rough, but hopefully we live. Be banded. He's not banded. Get, get, fold switch. All right, perfect. So he's going to go into Zard. Uh, he's probably just going to attack me. He's not going to roost. If he roosts, then he chokes, but I don't think he's going to choke. I think he's just going to attack me. I'm going to sleep talk. Maybe we get Dragon Pulse. <laughs> no, he's just going to hit me with an Earthquake. All right, fair enough. So we just lost this guy. That's horrible. I should not have let my uh, Pokemon get weakened by his Dusk Noir. That's terrible that we lost, but that's fine. We're going to beat this guy. Okay, we're going to beat this guy. That's fine. We're going to beat this guy. So, his lead is looking like Donphan, which means my lead is looking like Keldeo. Uh, Keldeo actually does a lot against this guy, except for Sceptile uh, and Sylveon. Yeah, so, uh, I mean, I can, I, this, this thing's fine. I'm just going to go for a Scald. Scald should to it kill. I mean, it has to. Right, guys? Burn, 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 burn. Nope. Fantastic. So I'm going to Scald again. He could let his Don Fan die here. Or he could switch out. I'm assuming he's just going to let it go down. If he wants to save it, that's cool. I shard doing zero. All right, so we're going to Scald and kill his Don Fan. Now I'm going to have to switch out. I'm assuming he's going into, yep. So Heatran pretty much walls this. Um, actually, not even pretty much. Heatran walls unless he hits a Focus Blast, which would be really annoying. He's going to Leech Seed my Heatran. Okay, then. I want to get up my own rocks. I also want a lava plume. I'm going to get up my rocks. If he wants to sub, I can just roar him out next turn. Uh, I'm going to get up my rocks against his Chun Li. Um, I'm not sure what that's a reference to. Not actually sure what that's a reference to. But, um, Thunderous kind of walls this, right? Thunderous or Ampharos or Keldeo. I'm going to go into Keldeo. I'm going to take this Rock's damage. He goes for a Fake Out, of course, and does zero damage. Uh, I outspeed. I can Scald and get a Burn. What I'm actually going to do is Secret Sword on the Switch. Right? Right? No, I'm going to Scald for a Burn. Because if I can Burn his uh, for Alligator, that would be amazing. He actually brings in Sylveon. Burn. Nope. Um, Unfortunately, I'm not going to be able to kill this thing in two hits. He's just going to go for a what appears to be a Hyper, a hyper Voice. Uh, so I'm just going to switch into Drill now. I can get off a free Rapid Spin. Hopefully he goes for Draining Kiss. Fantastic. Uh, I can just go for a Rapid Spin now and get rid of his rocks. So no more Hazards for him. Hazards for me. Um, I don't think he's going to stay in on me. No, he didn't. So I can just go ahead and spin these away. Um, then I can switch into Heatran. He might Leech Seed, but then what? You know? Um, yeah, I feel like that's the best switch. I'm just going to switch into Heatran here. Uh, I was thinking about maybe something else, but I think Heatran's just the best switch, to be honest. So Leech Seed, obviously, is going to be kind of annoying, but not a big deal. I'm just going to go for a double. That's he might bring out his Mian Chao, so I'm just going to double into my... I'm going to go into Ampharos here, and I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to explain why. Because if he brings out me and Chow, I can get up this hit. And uh, actually, you know what? No, no, no. I'm just going to go for Lava Bloom because I want to get some damage off of me and Chow. 
Yeah, I just want to get some damage off on it. If I can burn, that would be amazing. Burn, please. 30% chance. 30% chance to burn. Pokemon, what is happening? I'm just going to stay in. He's going to fake out, so I'm just going to take this fake out damage. Oh, he missed! Oh, nice. Wow, so we did kind of get some hacks there. I'm going to be honest. Like, I miss high jump kicks so much and play rough and icy wind and every 90% accurate move that I don't feel bad when people miss these moves. I don't feel bad for them. I, I have no... I can't feel bad for them. Anyway, he's going to go into Gator, which is just going to give me a free switch into anything I want, really. Um, My switching of choice is probably Keldeo. Uh, I don't really need it anymore. It's useful for Delphox, but I can handle Delphox. Well... Well, it's too late now. Dragon Dance, calm yourself. What's this guy to hit me, Crunch? Crunch isn't touching me. Crunch is actually not touching me at all. So I'm just going to go for Secret Sword on this thing. Should do quite a bit. He switches out to Sylveon, that's cool too, I guess. Be annoying, but whatever. So this is going to do a lot. Yeah, that did so much. And I do have priority in Bisharp. I can just hit him with a Sucker Punch. So I might have sat Keldeo here to this. Not that big of a deal to me. I'm gonna be honest. I mean, he just got he just got kind of um, he got kind of greedy, and I'm not sure why he crunched. Crunch is probably doing less than Waterfall. So interesting, interesting, uh, interesting series of plays. Wouldn't hurt my feelings at all if he goes out into his Sceptile. He probably he might just go into Delphox. Oh, okay, well that's actually fine. He's just gonna kill me with a Giga Drain or something. Which is fine with me. No big deal. Dragon Breath. <laughs> okay, friend. Dragon Breath it is. So, um, I'm just going to go into Tran now. And go for Lava Plume. I mean, what, what's his play of choice? Leech Seed. Gone. That lived. We didn't get a burn either. I'm just going to hit it again. Lava Plume did 51 last time. Yeah, I'm going to hit him again. What's he going to Giga Drain for like 10%? Synthesis. What is this Sceptile? I am kind of befuddled, actually. I don't have any Ice type. Oh, I've got HP Ice. Never mind. We're fine. Never mind. He's going to go for a Dragon Breath. That did a lot. I'm going to go for HP Ice here. Um, if he wants to stay in, that would be cool. Uh, if, he can, if he wants a Dragon Breath, that would be okay as long as he didn't crit or para me. Dragon Breath. It's really weird. Really, really weird. He's going to go out into his Delphox. I do show that I have HP Ice, which is kind of bad for me. But not that big a deal as uh, I'm faster. I don't know if he eats up a Thunderbolt. I think my safest play is to go into Heatran, though. I think it's my safest play. Uh, he goes for a Light Screen. <laughs> my gosh. What is happening? Does this Roar Screen... He doesn't get rid of Screens, does it? I'm just going to Toxic this thing. Or Sceptile. <laughs> zero. Zero, zero, zero. So, I can just roar him out. Into something else. Or I can just Lava Plume to get damage off on him. Lava Plume's not doing any damage. I'm going to force him to bring this back in on rocks. That's going to take, what, 25 away from him? So, uh... Maybe he'll bring out Sceptile. Or Sylveon. That would be great. And I can just roar one of them out. Um, this is This is looking like it's going to go my way. Uh, a bulky Sceptile with Synthesis is kind of weird, but I think we can handle it. We do have HP Ice on uh, Thunderous. I just don't, I can't switch into Sceptile anymore. Perfect. Goodbye. Perfect. Perfect. I'm going to roar again. And I think he's just trapped in this roar cycle now. He can Psy Shock me, but that's doing literally nothing. So I can just roar him back out into his Sylveon, who can't touch me either. And then I can just go for a Lava Plume straight up. Or a roar. I'm just going to roar. What's Sylveon doing? Drain and Kiss is not touching me. Uh, Hyper Voice is not going to do much. So, what is this moveset? Why, why am I battling this guy? <laughs> why, is this, why is this not over? Zero. Sceptile is going to take a nice chunk from uh, from rocks there. I'm just going to Lava Plume. It is my best play. It does 50%, I think. Right? I think 50%. He might Synthesis. He just leads Seeds. This should kill him. Yep. Fantastic. All right, cool. So I think we just win now. Uh, his, his Sceptile's out of the way. That was the biggest threat. So uh, now I can just come in and do whatever, whatever I want. I could just stay in with Heatran and recover, but like recover damage just based off of leftovers and roar. But I can't actually do that. 
because, um, lead seed now, but that's not that big of a deal to me. Um, I don't know what exactly he thought I was going to do. <laughs> if he thought I was going to just go for another roar, but why would I do that? Um, anyway, this guy is probably not going to come back. I feel like he's going to just leave. Um, we'll give him a, we'll give him a couple of seconds. Um, I have really, uh, enjoyed OU on stream a lot lately. Uh, I've actually made a decision on OU to only play, um, to only play, I'm going to actually switch out. What do I switch into? Thunderous does nothing for me. Um, to only play OU, Ubers, and UU as well. Um, those are the only three that I actually care to play right now at this point. Um, I'm faster than this thing, by the way. So he's just going to forfeit. That's cool. We're going to get another win under our belt. I would love to get 1,200 by the end of this this uh, this episode, but I don't think that's going to happen. Anyway, this guy's got a pretty interesting looking team. He's got a meow stick. I don't know why. Low ladder. I mean, you know, what can you say? Mega Altari is kind of scary, though. Anyway, um, me not having the ice type moves is kind of a problem. Uh, I do have, obviously, hidden power ice, but still. I don't have any dra Oh, I do have dragon pulse. Um, anyway. His lead, I don't know what it is. I'm just going to lead with Heatran because I think it's a good universal lead against anything except Gator. And he leads with Meowstic, so it is a good lead. So I can just go for Rocks. What's he going to go for here? Prankster Thunder Wave? Maybe? I don't even know what Meowstic actually runs. I don't even know what tier it is. I think it's NU, right? He's going to put up screens. That's cool. I'm just going to go for Roar now. As his screens will stay up, he's going to go into Gudra. Gudra can't actually touch me unless it has an Earth Power, but I don't think it will. That would be really strange if it did. I'm just going to go for Toxic, though. Because Gudra's kind of bulky, and, and it's something I don't want to deal with. He goes for Dragon Tail. All right. Bisharp. Um, not not the one that I wanted. I'm going to be honest. Not the one that I wanted. Not that big a deal, though. I'm just going to knock off. I think it's the best thing I can do. That did a lot. Is he gooey? He's Sap Sipper. Flamethrower. Okay, then. Calm down, Gudra. Um, I can just go for Sucker Punch. It should kill this thing. It might not. It didn't. So I'm going to lose my Bisharp a little early. A Bisharp didn't do a whole lot for me except handle Meowstic, but I think I can handle Meowstic. It's pretty frail, I think. So um, Maybe I should have kept it alive, but Gudra was going to be a problem because it was really it's really bulky. I wish I would have killed it with a Sucker Punch, to be honest, but what can you do? What can you actually do? Oh, i got to pick my mom. Whoops. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing. Um, Heatran. And Toxic. What does he actually have for Heatran? He's only got for Alligator for me. I'm actually going to go into Thunderous. Not sure what he's going to bring out. He's going to bring out Porygon 2. That's kind of annoying. Um, he, he got Prankster now. That's kind of scary. I'm going to go for... <sighs> Something's going to get hurt really bad by this. I think I'm just going to go into Ampharos or Excadrill. Um, I'm going to go into Excadrill here. Um, assuming he's just going to go for... Okay, then. Don't freeze me. Thank you. That was pretty scary. I'm just going to go for a Toxic now. Uh, if he wants to leave this in, that's cool. Uh, if he wants to take it out, or uh, switch it out, then something's going to get poisoned, hopefully. As he does switch out into his Gator, this is going to get toxic uh, which is good for me. Uh, this was the thing that I was worried about the most. Um, obviously, this means that I can't paralyze it now, which is kind of annoying. But not that big a deal. I'm just I kinda just want to switch out to Ampharos, but I think my better play is to switch out to Ampharos. I'm gonna switch out to Ampharos, it's the best play. He I'm assuming he's gonna Dragon Dance. I've seen a lot of for alligators, that's two so far. He's just gonna DD, but that's fine. Um, I've got a rest on this. I'm not gonna Mega Evolve though. Because he's probably gonna Ice Bright, exactly. So Volt Switch should do a lot. It actually kills. Perfect. So um, why is that little... Okay, never mind. He is going to get the initiative. Uh, what does he have left? He has... Uh, he has Thunderous. Kills this. Thunderous can kill that. Um, okay. Thunderous is probably the best thing to go out into because I'm Prankster. And I can just go ahead and get off a T-Wave on something. I think that's the, that's the best thing for me to do. Um... Yeah, that's the best thing for me to do right now, is to just get off a T-Wave. If he goes into Altari, I can HP Ice, but why? Um, actually, why do you bring this out? Set up screens again? I'm just going to T-Bolt. not sure what he's... I'm sure he's probably going to set up screens, right. 
Um, that did zero, by the way. Setting up screens isn't going to help this guy, though. I, I hope he knows that. Um, just going to T-wave. Whatever comes out. Oh, he stayed in. Cool. What do you go for? Psychic? That did zero, too. Um, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna Thunderbolt now, I guess. I don't want to let this thing get weakened though. That's a problem. Um, what do I have for Psychic? Heatran. Yeah, Heatran pretty much walls this guy's uh, meow stick. Actually, kind of walls the rest of his team if you think about it. Yeah, it walls the rest of his team except for maybe Porygon. He gets paralyzed. Don't think it matters. I mean, he's, he wasn't gonna do anything anyway. Um, just gonna go for Lava Plume. He's going to go into Altaria. That's kind of what I thought. Um, he's probably just going to Dragon Dance, but... I mean... Do I care, though? Not really. I'm going to go into Thunderous on his Dragon Dance, and I'm going to go for a uh, Prankster Thunder Wave. We're going to paralyze this thing. He could stay in and kill my Thunderous. He could switch out into Meowstic, but he loses his Dragon Dance, so... I think it's a little early for him to try to be setting up and going for a game with Altaria, if I'm honest. Because now this thing is paralyzed. Yeah, this thing's going to get paralyzed. And uh, I can just hit it with an HP Ice and see how much it does. It should do quite a bit. Yeah, it did. We got a crit. I don't know if that mattered, though. Return's going to kill me, which is fine. Because now I don't need Thunderous anymore. This was the threat. This was the issue. This was the problem. So, um, thinking I can just go into Keldeo. But I think Heatran's safer. Heatran is safer because nothing can touch Heatran. This is going to do something, but not too much. I'm just going to Lava Plume. As a, okay, we outspeed anyway. I thought we, I'm, I was assuming we would. I am slow, but I didn't think I was that slow. Um, so he's just going to go into Porygon 2 now. Um, he traced Flash Fire, which is kind of annoying. I'm just going to Toxic this thing, though. What's he doing to me? Does he have Earthquake? Psy Shock? That does zero. Now I just roar him out. I just toxic everything and roar roar everything out. Alright, cool. So he's going to leave, knowing that we've already won the battle. So 3-0 and in this... No, we're not 3-0. and I lost. 3-1? and 2-1. and 3-1? and 3-1. 3-1 and and here in this uh, OU Live, this uh, Learning Ladderings episode. Um, this guy's team looks pretty interesting as well. A lot of UU Mons, Milotic, Umbreon... Um, Bomba Snow, Azelf. He's only got two OU Mons in this team, so interesting. Um, kind of thinking he's just gonna leave with a Bomba Snow. I'm gonna leave with Heatran. He may leave with Rotom, but if he does, then I'll I'll adjust accordingly. But I'm gonna go into Heatran now for basically for free. Or I'm gonna lead. Well, it is for free. I'm just leading off. I'm gonna leave with Heatran though. I'm also gonna start the timer on this guy too. We'll see how long he wants to take to pick his mons. Shouldn't take too long. It's it's uh, pretty straightforward. I would. Oh, he's, he picked his elf. Fair enough. Fair enough. Not a bad lead. Uh, let this thing gets defog or not. Um, I kind of just want to go for rocks. I'm gonna go for rocks and then go for roar. He's probably just gonna try to set up his own rocks, or he could potentially. Um, yeah, that's what he did. I thought he might be screens, but he's not. I'm just gonna roar. He might he might boom here, but I doubt it. Um, it wouldn't be much wouldn't make much sense. He's just gonna knock my leftovers off, which is kind of annoying, but doesn't matter. I uh, bring in Jirachi, which is good for me, bad for him. I'm just gonna lava plume for free. He might pull a double into his Rotom. I'm gonna predict his Rotom, and I'm gonna go into Drill. Uh, that's stupid. Uh, that's even stupider. <laughs> I want to get. Uh, I don't know. I don't know what to do now. Kind of scared. My load is a really big problem for my team. I'm going to spin these rocks because I don't need drill too much. I could use drill, and he's helpful. This is just going to scald. That's going to do a lot. He got a burn, of course. Of course, Pokemon. Thank you so much. See, that just makes drill useless now. I could have used him against Rotom. But, alas, that makes him useless. He's just going to HP ice. Okay, or HP ground. Interesting. Doesn't have a Thunderbolt switch in that I can see. Also doesn't have a Thunder Wave switch in I can see. I'm just going to T-Bolt though. I'm just going to T-Bolt here. Um, it, I think it's the best play. 
He doesn't have a switch in for it. If he wants to go into Obama Snow, that's fine. That's actually fine if he wants to do that. Um, he's going to go into Umbreon to eat this Thunderbolt up. But I have Focus Blast, so this should not kill Umbreon, but should do a lot. He might Toxic me, which would be kind of annoying. I'm going to Focus Blast, though. See if we can get a hit. Please. If there, if there is ever a time I need to Focus Blast, hit it now. Please, Pokemon. Please. Pokemon, please. Oh, I need this hit so bad. Please, Pokemon. He's just going to Toxic or Wish. But I need this to kill. It's not going to kill, but it's going to do a lot. I think. This shouldn't be my only fighting type move on the team either. Oh, it's not. I've got Secret Sword. What am I doing? Oh my god, of course I missed. Anti-Toxic me. Of course I missed. I'm going to go for Thunderbolt now. I'm assuming he's switching out. Into something to take this Focus Blast. But uh, I can just stay in a Thunderbolt. It's so annoying. Of course I missed. He's just going to protect. This guy's stupid. That's really annoying. I'm really... I'm, I mean, that, like... I, I understand Focus Blast 70 accuracy, whatever, but... it's all, It almost never hits when you need it to. Never. Did he switch out? He did not. He just went for a double protect. This guy's cancer. Uh, I can just... I can just go for a secret sword here. Which is what I'm going to do. He's probably going to switch into his elf and make me switch out, but I'd switch out into Heatran, which is not a big deal. Yep. So I could just go for Secret Sword. That did enough to where I can hit him with another one. He's outspeeding me, though. Uh, maybe trying to get up rocks. Hope he doesn't boom on me. That would be annoying. I'm actually just going to go into... No, I'm actually just going to go for Secret Sword. Assuming he's getting up rocks. Don't boom. He did. That didn't kill. Luckily, that didn't kill, because now I can still kill Umbreon with this. I need Keldeo to stay alive for Umbreon. Oh my gosh, that's so annoying. I really thought he would want to get up rocks, but he can't now anyway, so that's good. All of his mods are going to be taking rock damage now. Um, Rachi might be going for either an Iron Head or a um, Zen Headbutt, so I feel like Bisharp is my best switch to this right now. It's Bisharp. Unless he goes for Fire Punch, which would be kind of annoying. Wouldn't, I don't know why he would do that. I mean, I, I can get the thought process. Maybe I go into Bisharp, but you're going to risk going for a Fire Punch against Keldeo? That's the play I would make, probably. I'm going to be honest. But hopefully he doesn't have Fire Punch. Let me say that. He has U-Turn. Of course he got a crit. Of course. Fantastic. So, anyway, he's going to go out into his... Um... Milotic? Rotom? Rotom probably has Willow. Rotom would be my guess. If Rotom has Willow, it's coming out now. Um, if not, then I would assume it's Milotic. It is Milotic. Okay, so we know Rotom doesn't have Willow. Because if he did, he would have just gone for it then. Um, Hidden Power Ground probably coming my way. I'm going to go into Thunderous. So he does go for HP Ground. Okay, so now I just Focus Blast on his Umbreon switch. Please hit. No, I pull a double into Keldeo. I'm going to pull a double into Keldeo, hoping that he goes into Umbreon here. He recovers. Shh, this, guy. this guy's too much for me. This guy's too much. Who stays in on a Thunderous and recovers? Who? Why? Why would you? Why would anyone? Go back into Thunderous. Why would he stay in? Why? Why would he stay in? Why? Please tell me. Dragon Pulse, huh? What is this? What's this guy doing? I'm going to Thunderbolt. See how much it does. Should do quite a bit. Uh, he's just going to switch an number on now, isn't he? He didn't. He stayed in on the Thunderbolt that I could have killed him with. And he has a Citrus Berry. Stop. I can kill this now. I'm going to go for the kill. No, I'm not. I'm going to switch into Keldeo. I'm going to get that Umbreon. I'm going to get that Umbreon right now. Don't go for recover. Perfect. 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 Secret Sword, I get a free one. Um, assuming that he's going to bring out Rotom. Uh, Rotom, my Lodic, or Rachi. Probably Rachi, if I had to take a guess. Rachi's going to... Okay, then. We're staying and let his Umbreon go down. Fantastic. 
My Lodic's not a big problem, as long as I can keep Thunderous alive. Uh, what is this switching for this? I'm assuming this is Scarfed. He's just going to U-turn again. I'm just going to Secret Sword. I'm going to let Keldeo go down here. Actually, I don't want to do that. I don't want to do that. I'm going to go into Drill. The only reason I'm going into Drill here is because I'm assuming he's Scarfed. Fire Punch. Perfect. So he's going to kill Drill, which I don't care about at all. Um, now I get a free switch into Heatran, and then I get a free double into my Tornadus, as I'm assuming his Milotic is going to come out. Or Rotom Wash. So I'm actually going to go straight into my Tornadus here. Assuming he's Scarfed. Okay, that's, a that's assuming he's Scarfed. That's fine. That's fine. I'll take this damage. I'll take this damage. I'm going to T-Bolt this. I'll take this damage. Because Ampharos can handle my Lodic as well. I will take this damage that I get. Whatever he brings in, I'll take the damage. I'm assuming he's Spadef Rotom Wash. I think that's what people run. I don't actually know for sure. Yeah, he is. So Volt Switch is going to kill me. Uh, now I get the priority, or the not the priority necessarily, but I get the uh, initiative as, as to see where he goes. So um, hopefully he goes into... This will be the last battle of the video, by the way. I don't, I don't really care what he goes into because I've got counters for all of them. Except maybe Obama Snow. But no, I mean, I've got Keldeo. Keldeo is the Obama Snow counter, right? <laughs> he goes into Scarf Rachi. Um, I can just go into Heatran. And uh, fire off Toxic on something, I think. Assuming he's not staying in. If he stays in a Lava Plume, this guy's wild. If he stays in, this guy is crazy. But I will get a free Toxic off on something, which will be really nice. Maybe my Lodic comes in now so we can recover a little bit of, of HP back. That would be my best guess, is he's going to go into my Lodic. Um, that way he can eat up this Lava Plume that he's expecting that's coming his way. And um, then he can... Yeah. Please go into my Lodic or Rotom. Don't go into Obama Snow. That would be such a bad play. I mean, who would make that play? Why would he ever go into Obama Snow? I'm trying to I'm trying to give myself some some encouragement here. <laughs> I'm trying to just give myself some encouragement here. I just want to make sure that he wouldn't go into Obama Snow. Perfect, perfect. So he's gonna get toxic. He's obviously gonna just go for a recover. So I'm gonna switch right out into Ampharos. Right out into Ampharos. If he doesn't go for recover, this guy is absolutely wild. If he goes for a skull, this guy is crazy. HP ground. That's absurd. He didn't recover. Wow. I want a Mega, but part of me doesn't because of his Obama Snow. I'm just going to go straight for a Volt Switch. Actually, no, I have to Mega. I'm going to Mega and go for a Volt Switch. I have to Mega. I'm assuming he's just going to switch out into maybe Rachi or Obama Snow, but uh, I he did he stay in? Wow, this guy's crazy. Alright, so he's going to sack into my Lodic here. Interesting play on his part. That HP ground literally does zero to me. So now he gets the initiative to see where he wants to go. Um, I am going to go into Keldeo and pray that he goes into Rachi because then I can just switch out into my Bisharp. Assuming, actually I would switch out into Heatran. I'm going to switch out to Heatran, because I can use Bisharp for Rachi, even though he's Scarfed. He's going to go Rachi here, or Obama Snow. That's what I was thinking. So I am outspeeding this, and I'm going to go for a Secret Sword. This should do a ton. I'm assuming he's Mega as well. That would be the only reason I could see him bringing this. Right. That is going to kill. Not sure why I brought it in. Just to sack it off to me, I guess. It wasn't scaring me out. I mean, I'm, I'm faster, obviously. So, interestingly enough, he brings that in to sack it off. I um, guess that's all right. So now he's got hail. That is going to put his uh, Rachi and Rotom. It's going to at least take some damage off on him. I'm just going to go for Secret Sword. I'm this is now we're going to definitely see if he's scarfed. I'm going to assume that he is. He is. He goes for Trick. He's going to get my specs, which is good for me, bad for him. Don't know why he went for Trick. 
literally have no idea. I literally have zero idea why he went for Trick. So... I'm gonna go into Bisharp, and I'm gonna go for Pursuit. I think he's switching out, going for Pursuit. If not, then he fire punches me, and that's gonna hurt. Perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. So now he's gonna go to Rotom. He's gonna take Rocks damage. Um, he's gonna take Hail damage for three turns, or at least two more turns, I think. But I don't think the battle's gonna last two more turns. I think we have, uh, I think we've won. I'm gonna knock off on this Rotom, whatever he's holding. He's going to be gone. He's probably just going to Pain Split here, uh, if I had to guess. Pain Split would be his play. I don't think he can win. I don't think he can stall me out to win. I'm pretty sure that I'm going to get this victory here. Um, yeah, knockoff. We just outspeed. Okay. Anyway, we're going to get a win right there. We're going to end the video. We're at 11.32. We started at the bottom, and now we're at 11.32. So that's something. Uh, we lost one battle, but we won the rest. So that's something as well. If you guys enjoyed the video, make sure you leave a like, comment, subscribe down below. If you haven't already, hit that subscribe button. If you want Pokemon Showdown content coming to your computer screens or your TV every single day of your lives, except for like Saturdays and Sundays. Well, there's still Pokemon Showdown there. Anyway, doesn't even matter. Um, also, I wanted to make this announcement here at the end of the video, uh, just for you guys, a little special sneak peek for you guys that are, uh, you know, sticking around through the whole video. Um, I am going to be starting a Let's Play probably either sometime this week or next week so keep an eye out it's gonna be pokemon sapphire it's gonna be a randomized nuzlocke i already recorded the first episode and it is hype i i was so happy after i got done recording the first episode it was crazy so if you guys want some of that on the channel make sure that you stick around and keep an eye out but with that being said i'm gonna get up out of here and i'll see you guys in the next video i'm out